the book uh, was, uh, enabled the authors to spend the time looking at each of America's generations and then in sort of the rear view mirror, they didn't go in with this hypothesis, they noticed that there were these four archetypes, personalities, that repeated in the same order each 80 years. Uh, they saw, for instance, that a hero archetype, like the GI generation, like the millennial generation, that we'll talk about in a bit, um, was always followed by uh, a silent or artist archetype. Uh, and, in, and it always followed a nomad archetype like Gen X. And it's, it's in this uh, sort of cyclical nature that led to Bill and Neil's prediction that we'd see an improved youth generation by the year 2000, because that's exactly what we saw with the GI generation. It was a generation of improving youth trends throughout its youth period. So that was what gave them this opportunity to think differently about outcomes down the road in a nonlinear way. Uh, their second book together was uh, 13 Gen. It was a story about Generation X. The third book, The Fourth Turning, uh, 1997, which allowed Bill and Neil to look at what were the formative factors creating this cyclical, repeating, generational uh, archetype sequence. And they believe that these turnings are responsible for that. In fact, that uh, they saw a, a high always followed by an awakening, always followed by an unraveling, always followed by a crisis. And there have been four such cycles that have taken place in, in this country.